I'm black. I collect anime. So get used to it. Be the the anime master. 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 Dragon Ball Z the anime master. Here we go the anime master. Dragon Ball Z the anime master. Here we go the anime master. What's up, y'all? Be the the anime master is back for anime DVD and Blu-ray reviews. Today, I'm going to be reviewing Speed Graffer, Volumes 1 through 6. This is Volume 1, so yeah, released by Funimation. Stay tuned for the review. Okay, this is the uh, original six single DVDs released by Funimation Entertainment for Speed Graffer. Released between July 2006 and I believe March, no, um, yeah, March 2007, I think. So yeah, this is uh, volume one. I picked these bad boys up, you know, every time, you know, they came out, you know, July, November, January, you know, all the way until I got the final volume. Uh, I, I was buying them at Best Buy for $20 each. So yeah, never again will I buy an anime series and singles because that was just, just, just retarded of me, but eh, whatever. So yeah, uh, these are the singles, you know, great packaging, great box art, you know what I'm saying? Hey, it's fucking speed graph, you know what I'm saying? About this shit as a blind buy you know i never seen the original japanese version uh when funimation announced that it had a speed grapher i was interested in, in to knowing what it was because it was a tvma title and since i was a huge fan of gas i wanted to find more tvma related uh, anime series so uh, funimation had a speed grapher site up and i checked it out checked out the clips of the dub and looked at it really really interesting to me so i picked up volume one and after i watched volume one i was hooked i loved the dub it was a great great story now I'm going to give you a small synopsis of uh, Speed Graphic because it's been a while since I've watched the series. You know what I'm saying? So let me give you a quick, uh, you know, rundown of the show. Speed Graphic starts off with this photographer named Tatsumi Saiga. He is a photographer. He takes pictures of, you know, children, buildings, drugs, gangs, you know, police related uh, materials, anything basically. So Tatsumi, you know, he's basically bored with his, you know, photography life and everything. And so he, he tries to get the dirt on some, you know, certain people. So this certain organization you know what i'm saying as he uh gets closer and gets more intrigued about learning the underground the tokyo underground i don't remember what the group was called i haven't seen the series in like two years so bear with me it's a quick synopsis anyway so after tatsumi figures out a way to break in into these secret clubs and secret underground meetings meetings and stuff he gets caught up and he gets slashed up but before he gets slashed up you know sliced up with swords uh he uh, kisses this so-called goddess or princess, as as the people are calling her, and she gives Saiga a special ability. And his new special ability allows him not to really die. Basically, he's kind of immortal a little bit. So he once once he gets sliced up, his body heals very quickly, and he has a new power, which his uh, I think his left eye, whenever he takes a, a photo of the with the camera, it blows up whatever is in focus, like it like a like a blown up camera, like a camera that blows shit up. You know, Speed Graffer is a very adult series, you know what I'm saying? A lot of strong, you know, language and strong fucking sexual content, which is very hilarious. But it's a great anime series if you're, you know, over the age of 15, 16 at least, you know what I'm saying? It was on TV, on IFC, uh, Uncut Channel, back in 2007 or 8, I believe. And uh, it's a lot more characters that have special abilities. It's a character that stretches, stretches his bones and shit. It's a character that uh, turns into glass and shit. It's a character that has like a super, super high sense of smell. There's a lot of, you know, awesome characters in this series. I'm not going to spoil too much, you know what I'm saying? Got to check it out. So, uh, these uh, single DVDs are pretty, pretty cheap now on Right Stuff. So, check that out. I think it's like $4 a piece. Something like that. Get the box sets, you know. I doubt Funimation is going to put this shit on Blu-ray, but you never know. So, yeah, you know. Speed Graphic was an okay series. It wasn't the best series, you know what I'm saying? But I, I like it, you know what I'm saying? It's in my collection. So, yeah. So yeah, check it out, you know, looking for some new anime. I'm B-Dub, the Anime Master. Peace.